Hi, boys and girls. How are you? This is your coach, Noel, and I'm so excited to be working with you today on this math lesson. Parents, I want to welcome you. Boys and girls, this is going to be a really quick lesson, okay? So let's go ahead and get started. So what we're looking at right here is a number line. Here we have a number line. We start with 0, and we go all the way to 10. So the reason I have this here highlighted in this circle is because what we're doing is just from 0 until 1, we're expanding it. And you see how here we have the 0? This is actually 1. Okay, so what we're doing is we're splitting this up into two pieces. So here is piece number one, and on this side is piece number two. So from here to here, that's one half, one over two. How many pieces do I have? I've got two pieces. This is the first piece, one over two, that's one half. The next piece is going to be two over two. Okay, because that's two pieces right there, and this is the second piece. All right, and remember, anytime you have a two over two, or a three over three, or a four over four, or a five over five, or a hundred over a hundred, it's always going to equal one. You see how that one's right there? This is actually a one as well. Two over two is a one. Okay. Let's go ahead and let's take a look at the next one. The next one we're going to be taking a look at thirds. One third, two thirds, and three thirds. Remember, we're looking at this number line here that goes to 10, but we're only going to look at this piece right here from 0 to 1. And we're going to break this up into three pieces piece number 1, piece number 2, and finally piece number 3. So here we have our numerator, which is 1. This is our first one. How many pieces do we have in all? Three. There you go. So here we have one third. Okay, that's our first piece. Now we have two thirds because there's one, two pieces there. Up until this point, that's two thirds. And now we're going to have three thirds here because from here all the way here, there's one, two, three pieces. So that's going to be three thirds. And remember, three thirds is equal to what? it's equal to 1. Okay, take a look. We started at 0 right there and we're only looking up until number 1 which is right there. All we did is we just magnified it and made it bigger. That's all we did. Okay, and that's pretty much it. All we're taking a look at right now is just number lines with fractions. Easy, easy, easy boys and girls. I want you to get comfortable being able to recognize and understand how fractions look on a number line. Parents, I want to thank you again. Boys and girls, you're doing an outstanding job.